Hello. You're not Ashin. Correct again. You're strictly better. <laughs> Some might say. You might say. I would say. Few others. No. no. All right. This is Legacy Cube. Hey, Owen, what do you know about Legacy Cube? I have very little idea. You keep bringing me to cubes, expecting me to know things like card names and effects and what Trample does. <laughs> I don't know any of the above, but Dennis... You guys can just watch Magic Online shit its pants for a little bit while this draft tries actually, to fire. It was very impressive joining this queue. It was like, bam! It's the fastest I've ever seen your Magic Online go. But Ever since I got a new computer, my Magic Online has been... Oh, oh, oh bye! Oh, see ya, man. What? <laughs> nah, man. It hates you. There we go. Quick. 18 seconds. Pick a card, Owen. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. Uh, <sighs> I really like, I like the art on Old Man on the Sea, so it's I'm glad to go with that. Though. It's not a great card, yeah. Banishing Light. Banishing Light's most versatile. See, this is a really bad pack. I guess we can take Woodfall Promise. Not, not very versatile, though. I I'm think Banishing, Banishing Light, Light is right the now. most versatile. Okay. Dun, 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 this dun. pack has some of my favourite cards in it. In not limiting, but including... Counter spell, Mold Drifter, Kitchen Finks, and Cloudgoat Ranger. Okay, Cloudgoat Ranger surely fits into a lot of different archetypes. It's just a good card. It's just a good so card. So is Mold Drifter, so is Counter Spell, so is Journey to Nowhere, so is Kitchen Finks. I would go Cloudgoat or Mold Drifter. I would go Cloud. I would also accept Kitchen Finks. Ancient Tomb is obviously very good. Mm. I don't. I find I have great trouble resolving gifts and given. Yeah. Because it's hard, so I'm not going to do that. Okay. Okay. <laughs> For you, Cloudgoat, Mold Drifter, or Finks. What do you reckon? Cloudgoat keeps us in the same color. So does Finks. So does Finks. I don't know. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not too sold on Finks. Honestly, Finks is pretty good. Is it? Yeah. You can get a pod. You could get a pod. You could also not get a pod. Ah, when has that ever happened anyway? <laughs> <laughs> get um, a pod. Wield the acidic slime. Combo off. Well, it's the lady's choice. I've never plastic a Cleogor Ranger in my entire life. Is this? Is this the moment for a Finks? Oh my god! I'm taking the Finks. You taking the Finks? Let's go green white value mid range. You know and Emrakul perfect here we go <laughs> rewarded um, here we have Venser Swords and Emrakul see I instinctively just want to go for Swords because I'm just like that's well, super powerful it's just a great card super efficient card um, Legacy Cube <clears throat> is a little looser than um, Women it's a little looser than Holiday Cube <laughs> like you don't have to do like a super busted thing okay you can just play a bunch of good cards and you're probably okay see I'm worried how, how like do we want to be? Do we want loads of creatures really quickly? That's how, totally how fine. Better creatures in the fine. They're okay. fine. They're actually pretty good. Okay. In Holy Cube, Finks is not a real card. Which Garruk is this now? My I like. Favorite. I like that Garruk. It's a really good Garruk. We're not actually in green yet. Technically. No, we're not at all. We're but just in white. Going into this would make our kitchen fix easier to cast. It would, and that is a really good. I like Planeswalkers. Yeah, that's my favorite. That's one of my favorite Planeswalkers. He has a plus ability. Makes three threes. Um, not zone. Zone, I think, is the best one. None of these make me. I was like, I was thinking, Super I was like, happy. you can pod, and you can pod, but we don't have the pod yet. No, we don't have the pod. You have to come down with your pod strats, all right, <laughs> Mister. Is this Traston on? Nah, I don't really like Traston's really expensive. Breaking sounds pretty good, I guess. Yeah. Plus, we can pod away the tokens. Can you do that? Do of course. One drops. Yeah, yeah. Get with it. Oh, dude, we can pod into our swords to play shares. We've got one creature. This is a great pod deck. <laughs> we have to stop calling it a pod deck. <laughs> <laughs> I love pod. I hope we get a pod. Do you? I'm gonna shit my pants. Why didn't you? Why didn't you mention that earlier on then? Hey, Owen, you want to shut up? <laughs> I don't ever. What do we got here? About me. Oh, oh, nothing. Kicked in the teeth. Um, Kaiga. Kaiga's pretty good. Kaiga. How do you say that? Kaiga. Um, Necrotal's really good. Searing blood's pretty good. Distant chance actually okay. I kind of want to go mm, maelstrom pulse. Go into. Junk. Junk, yeah. Just in case. Abzan, you mean. Oh, sorry. Sincerest apologies. Isn't that weird? Isn't Abzan. that weird? That I don't like going? it. I like, I call them all the, by their right names when I'm in cans. When you're playing, like, drafting? Yeah, but when I'm in anything else, I'm just like, no. Freelies is pretty good. Freelies is birds. pretty good. Birds. 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 Yeah. birds. When we get our pod... Shut up. It's the first pe... No, Owen, Dennis. Drop the pod. Listen to him. What do you mean me drop the pod? <laughs> you're the one who's the pod lover. Podman. 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 I saw a great movie the other day. You know what it was called? No. Birdman. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> we have a Birdman. We do have a Birdman. We have a bird. We have no moon. We'd be able to turn him into a two drop man as soon as we get our podman. We don't have any two drops. <laughs> oh, God. Our deck's falling apart. Um, Edric, fourth color. Fuck it. Here we go. <laughs> uh, Rafelos. No joke. Spirit Keeper's pretty good with pod. <laughs> okay. 
Someone, okay, let's just play under the assumption someone else already has the pod. We can't keep hedging our bets on pod. I, like I think Rafaelis is good because we can just randomly just decide to fist our way into green. To super green. Oh, dude. Get wheel back. That was a visual <laughs> joke. We were fisting the. You were I wasn't. Some. I know. I'm just saying we can just pray that there's a glitch and we get Jurassic on back. It's a glitch. It's totally plausible. <clears throat> Did we pass Woodfall Primus too? Yeah, what are we yeah. Rafaela singing to? I don't know. We passed Emrakul. Where's this going? <laughs> Garuk. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I wanted a two drop for the pod. Leave me alone. There are three things wrong with, that, with, that, with, the, with the word you just said. One, that's a terrible idea. Two, not a great ramp target. Three, Garuk. 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 Wait, what's that? What's that? A uh, blue, red, green. Teamer? You mean Teamer? I will throttle you. <laughs> throttle? Man, that's not in. Words. I will delay ah! you. Ah! Is it? Chameleon Colossus. That's what hey. we ran. Aww. Oh, Chameleon I Colossus. Tr- that's a pretty good card. And it's re- it's better than the pod chain. <laughs> you just, you're just making high I'm sorry. Time. I'm not used to this. Like, we could take the Primus. The Primus to come back. We got a bird. We got a Rafaelos. That's that kind of... We got an awakening zone. We're kind of mm, heading mm. that way. We're getting there. We just need the pod. Um, okay, so you want the Primus over the community. Build the blue white. Build the blue white ramp deal. Okay. So All right. The white is actually completely stricken. Well, get get rid of the pulse for now, I suppose. Yeah. Okay. But the, like, the pulse is just a maybe, maybe perhaps. But like, banishing light and swords are very similar. They're just like, here, we don't kill us with your big things. Yeah. And then we'll kill them with our big things. I love this Garrick. Can't blame. If you say Garuk again, I'm gonna kill you. He's not my favorite Garuk. No, he is. I just want to. I actually, I prefer. Hey! Oh, we could probably take the agent too, couldn't we? Are you passing? You've got. Yeah, I was about to say. <laughs> like, oh, I've never passed a Cloud Girl Ranger before. Pass it once. You're about to pass him again. That's. That's naughty, Dennis. Ancient 2 definitely would have been better for our deck. Probably, yeah, it would have been. But. <laughs> Primal Command, how can we lose? We're on four. Gain seven. Also, Gain, whatever. Same, the tutor, other... tutor creature. That's. I remember Primal Command was one of my first awful. my first ever EDH rares, and that was. I always just assumed it had one mode. Really? We could beam back. Could we? Could be. Oh, Chrome Mark's actually pretty good. Yeah. <clears throat> Woodland Cemetery. We could be in black. That's true. Look, the gods are pointing towards Would us. You, do you want to run this Chrome Mox? No. The strict one for two. I don't think we needed that much. Okay. We'll see. We'll come back to it. It's in, not like, it's not like, like we're done In my experience yet. in Legacy Keep, you can just pile up a bunch of good cards and then it's fine. Yeah. So, if we open pod now. I think we I think we pass it and hope we get it back. You think? Yeah. Just to... Just One drop, two drop, three drop, no four drop. No four drops! We I, we passed the Colossus. Well, That's that, what I was but, saying. Like, the Chameleon yeah, Colossus. Wait, wait. We need a four drop, then a five drop, six drop, seven we drop. We have a five drop. Then, oh yeah, we need a six drop and a seven drop and then we're in business. And we're just golden. Then we get out our... Woodfall Primus. Woodfall Primus. Who has Persist, so, so you we can, can pod, pod into our 9-drop. Which we don't Terastodon, he's gone. Nah, man, he'll come back. They always come there back. There he is, there is there. Oh, oh Terastodon! Take... That's not a dragon. That doesn't look like a dragon. It's the plain cycle dragon. Return, target, uh, okay. Sure, that sounds good. And we have Blood Gas, because we might be in black. I don't want to run No, we're never going to run Blood Gas in this deck. Wait, Super wait a minute, because when you pod him... You just that's actually pretty good. Yeah. That, I've done that before. That's yeah. pretty good. We're but, good. Um, We're golden. It's really busted if you can get skull clamp. Oh oh that's tasty. I had if a deck you got once, skull clamp right now. I had a deck once that had blood ghast, skull clamp, and bitter blossom. Yeah. I just drew my whole deck in the, over the course of like three turns. <laughs> and, and then and then what you, you just Oh I lost. You, but, you um, threw yourself out. But it was a good time. Yeah. I had fun. You just had those three cards on swamps. Alright. Warner Queen? There's a seven drop. Warner Queen the seven, is seven drop. <laughs> We don't have the pod. We gotta stop. No, we do have to stop with the curve nonsense. Um, She's just a super good card, though. But and this is the bad Elspeth. I don't like her. Okay, no. People think she's the better Elspeth. There, hang on. There's also a mirror battles here, which is probably just better than Horn Queen. Um, it is probably just better. Yeah. Hmm. They are flyers. Do we? Will we need to shore up the skies at any point in time? I mean, the battle sphere hits for twelve. That's true. If it connects, just yeah. plain and simple. But Horn of Queen's more of a, like a defensive card. We, 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 I Do we need to be defensive? No, I don't think. I think we have the battle sphere. Okay. 
Now we just need a six drop and also a birthing. And pod. a birthing pod would be good. Genesis wave or an elf. What's how many, What's the CMC of Progenitus there? Just in case we get the pod. Ten. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Can you, can you even pod for him? I think the elf is good. Elf or Genesis wave. Elf. I'm inclined to say elf because you don't have enough mana ramp, really. Rafelos and Awakening Zone are pretty solid. Rafelos especially. To justify a Genesis wave, though. I mean. We don't really have great targets for it yet. No. It has permanence, doesn't it? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Get the old Garuk. Garuk? You're clenching your fist and making faces. That's a physical joke, Dennis. <laughs> um, <laughs> Hero Blade Hole, probably? Uh, Sorry, anyone who's listening with headphones. Hero Blade Hole, probably, right? <laughs> yeah, that sounds good to me. Yeah. It's a four drop for a pod. <laughs> Dear God. Another we, seven drop. If we get the pod... It's gonna be happy days, but if we don't get the pod, well, this isn't a great pod target, isn't we? Really... Look, dude, we just need the. Pod. I mean, Finks into Hero Blade Hold with pod—that's pretty good. We only have one four drop, and we can pod our kitchen Finks twice. Okay, we need drops. another four drop, and then we also need to draw our cards in perfect sequence every game, and also draft pod. I think we've said pod too many times. If I had the will or the editing software, I'd have a pod count. Really. But you don't. N- neither of the neither above. Neither of the above. Not happen. No, 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 no. That's tragic. Well, you know. <clears throat> tomato, tomato. I was texting someone the other day, and they were like, oh, we should oh, do this. Oh, we're I have friends. All right, mate. <laughs> it was Oshin. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> it was, it was, it was, it was <laughs> And I said, they said something, and I replied with, ah, tomato, tomato, which does not work written down. No. <laughs> tomato, tomato. Just, tomato. Just like, tomato, tomato. <laughs> what? That's why I say potato, tomato. <laughs> uh, everyone likes you. What? Um, Sylvan Library, Indrix on Powder. Sylvan Library... Is or, my homeboy. It's also the Warhammer, a pretty creature heavy deck. Look, if we get Sylvan Library, we'll be able to dig for our. Buddy, the Warhammer pod. might actually be a plan. Because we've really? got. Yeah, like we've got Cloud Goat at. We can, oh, we can just chuck that on some Awakening Zone tokens. Yeah, just put it on. T- <laughs> make some Eldrazi go to down. Yeah, so it's on our, That actually might be a good pickup. Are the, is the Stomp Pile any good? Is there good it's, artifacts? There's tons of stuff. There's always something here. There's okay. always something here. Alright. So, you don't like the Library? I do, I do. I like Library a lot. It's a good card. Do we, do we like Library in this deck? Compared to... I think we might just want... I think the Warhammer might be better in this deck. I don't really like the Warhammer. I'm going to take the Warhammer. Really? Yeah. I think... I, I've, I've played with Library a bunch and it's good. I've already <coughs> played... Oh, Master of the Wild Hunt. Hunt. It's yeah. pretty good. Nis? No. Nis is good too, is but Master is yeah. like a value card. He is just super good. Also a second four drop for a pod. And he makes wolves to get that sweet, sweet mystic. Elvish, <laughs> Elvish mystic. <Yeah. laughs> hey buddy, Birds of Paradise locks on Warhammer. That's a thing. It is. It's like... Uh, Cobblade. It's with swords, yeah. It's basically Cobblade. Yeah. We're just building basically, Cobblade. We're just, Green, white, Cobblade. It's classic. the exact same deck. I think Mystic's in here. Give or take, like, one card. A deck list. Maybe. If if even that. I think we have a couple more forests as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is good. Rafelos looks so happy. Hello! I'm just going for a stroll. Um, <clears throat> a friend of mine made fun of me because of the way I say hello on the phone, which is the way I say hello in a video. Yeah. Because on the phone, I'm like, hello? Or like, hello, but here I'm always, hello! Just, because I always imagine whenever you intro videos, you'd say hello, but you also, you're doing jazz hands at the same time. You've been in like three videos now. You yeah, I know, but I, I, I close my eyes when you say hello. You close your eyes most of the time when you're around me. Yeah. Who can blame you? <clears throat> um, Gilded Lotus, Crafted War Gear, Equipment Theme, Explorers, meh. I I would go Gilded Lotus. Dicted. I'm sorry? Dicted of your language. <laughs> oh, oh, um, <laughs> I, 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 I would go Gilded Lotus, but. Yeah, it's pretty strong. Yeah. I'm a madman. Need some card draw now, though. Once you get the Lotus down, you need to, like. We make a lot of tokens. That's why I wanted the Warhammer. Dude. Between Garrick, Cloud Goat, Mirror Hero. Battle Sphere, Hero of Blade Hold, Master of the Wild Hunt, Awakening we didn't have Zone. Them. Awakening Zone. There's just, you just stick. And like when your elf runs out of utility in late game, you can just stick a Warhammer on it. Just bash go, for go for it. Be free. Elf. It's expensive. Like, Warhammer is an expensive card to use, but we have a lot of mana. Like, I think that's a thing. I think you're a thing. Library is obviously very good because you can filter away lands and you don't need them for a while until you start paying a lot of life for it. Mm. Ugh. <clears throat> cultivate, how did it cultivate? Um, I think cultivate is the best card here. How is it? This is just Kodama's Reach without Arcane, right? Yeah. Okay. Same card. Why would you know? How do you know Kodama's Reach and not cultivate? I don't know. What's wrong with you? I think Kodama's Reach is. You just love splicing into Arcane. Which one's on? Which one of the, is one of them in Modern Masters? wouldn't be able to tell you. I think Kodama's Reach. Yeah, because there was loads of arcane cards in Modern Masters. Yeah. It would be Kodama's Reach. Yeah. Cards of Bramage. Mm-hmm. Frontline Medic. 
Hero Blade or Hero Blade oh, Mentor of the Meek Condemn pretty good Condemn was what I was going uh, Mentor of the Meek We, as we say we make a lot of tokens how many 1-1s one do we make though we make whoa, with Awakening Zone a Mentor Straw of the card of return um, yeah. Hero Blade you, you can even can you pay can you pay for Mentor of the Meek's ability by sacking the Eldrazi you just made yes you just gotta draw yeah. a card every turn yeah let's do that yeah. that's a fun combo and in terms of one ones we have Elvish Mystic Bird's Paradise Rafelos as well it's power two or less mm. Kitchen Thinks twice or Kitchen Thinks only the second yeah, time second time Hero Blade holds to all of her tokens all the Awakening Zone tokens Master of the Wild Hunts tokens Cloud Goat Ranger's tokens and Mere Battles for his tokens as well and Elspeth and now Elspeth Terrell's the Tessin <laughs> tactic is actually pretty good do we fight though well they get plus two plus two don't they no plus one plus one plus one plus one well you can put slap that on a couple of tokens but I think Elspeth's just better alright I don't like this Elspeth I don't like the, uh, any planes where I could like protect itself with its minus oust it's oust target creature on to Anton's every second from the top nah that's annoying just take USA whoa are we going to play USA I, a flyer I guess sure, I mean we have 18 cards this is the way, yeah. this is the way like, it works and the curve's nice for when we get our pod yeah. ooh wow destiny check out our token yeah. It's not like we're playing any other cards, so He works with our um <coughs> Pod curve. Pod curve, but also our Token team. mentor of the make. Yeah. But I don't want to run him because he's double white and not very good. Oh I'll take that. Happy days. In Hathi is pretty good, but meh. Not Jackal Pup. Uh, oh. oh okay. Ah uh, no, our tokens are all green and colourless. No, they're except not for colorless. this and this. And Elspeth Thrill makes tokens as well, doesn't she? She does. Her minus makes soldiers. <laughs> Three. Oh yeah, her minus is Sun's Champions plus. Okay. Petrol Possession. Rancor. Day of Judgment. Is Thrun good enough? Thrun's pretty good with a Lockstone Warhammer. And does a four drop. We don't have the pot! What? <laughs> I thought that was our commander. The birthing pot was our commander. <laughs> <laughs> I'd play that deck. I sure would. Um, um, for Spectral Possession, how good is that? Not amazing, although it makes... Tokens, combos with thing. Combos with one of their card. I mean, combos ish with Divining Top? That's Isn't pretty, that just really good all the time? Pretty much. Do we have enough beat down? I mean, Thrun's. Thrun's just a solid Thrun's card. a good threat. Oh, I accident, oh. accidentally took Thrun. So. Well, you know what? He's a good guy. He deserves a day out. Tree Speaker? Tree Speaker, yeah. Fate's Fetter is pretty good. Sundering Time's an 8 drop, but. Nah. Tree Speaker. I don't know if we have enough RAM for this Woodfall Primus. No. Oh, the Between Rafellos. Birds well, Fellows elements. is only for forests, though. So we'll just play more forests. Findhorn, Rampant Growth. Mary Angel. Mm. She makes birds. She does make birds with land drop, though. We don't have that much. I would go Findhorn Elves. Now I'm pretty comfortable getting up into this area. Yeah. Oh, God, we have a lot of water. <coughs> Court of Calling, Garuk. Temple of Plenty. <laughs> Fran Dynamo. Oh, maybe just want the Dynamo. Do you want the Dynamo? Just go... <clears throat> like we're not running any Eldrazi or anything though. we have the Gilded Lotus we have the Awakening Zone we have all these elves do we need the Dynamo to get to Woodfall Primus like no. our two cards that are that high because like five's not that hard to get to Marshall Coup is a pretty good card to ramp into and it makes tokens which isn't really relevant because you've, you've killed, killed your poor mentor of the meek <laughs> or do you take Temple Plenty or do we take Court of Calling we don't want Temple well Court of Calling Court of Calling works with our all our tokens to get out our Woodfall Primus because you can convoke oh I suppose yeah for eleven yeah man Avengers Endicar is pretty good there's the Kadama's Reach <laughs> that's like Cultivate isn't it did you just take the Avengers <laughs> did you just take Avengers <laughs> Avengers pretty good yeah Avengers is pretty good 7 mana do we need do we want okay <laughs> <laughs> discussions for chumps yeah. more clicking probably want the Destiny whatever about the Destiny I think it costs too much I, try, I want to cut white cards because we're fellas if possible yeah um, I don't like this Elspeth I don't really no, I'm not too taken well, with her she will get us a dick ton of life I think then we'll bring her in if we need a dick ton of life. But like, I think if we oh we're at twenty three, so we're actually we'll actually sit for now, I guess. Plow under Thrag, Daddy, Oblivion Ring, Swag Tusk, Duplicant is insane. Uh, mm, yeah, Duplicant's pretty good. Duplicant. Removal? Do we need? I think do we need more removal as well? We have Swords, Banishing Light. That's it. I think Duplicant's good then. Yeah, it's a good turn. Yeah, I don't think we need the. The ramp for the value ten. Duplicate over Elspeth. Yeah. Oh, it's a six and drop it's a six drop. Oh my god, it's perfect. It really is. Twenty three plus thirteen is what thirty six. So we have two more hits to see if we hit that pod. Okay. If we, <clears throat> if we go into this first game, and and he plays turn three pod. I'm dropping out of the event. And yeah, I'll just it's done. I'm you leaving. Go I'm going home. We're out. I'll probably never play Magic again. 
Hey, Tree Speaker works with all of our other elves. It's pretty good. Yes. Probably not great with Rafaelos. Rafaelos is probably better by himself. Yeah. But the Finn He's so elves happy. Yeah, it's unreal. I just want Rafaelos to do well in life. Because, like, he's just such a cheery guy. <clears throat> doesn't he, doesn't he, spoilers, doesn't he die in the lore? I have no, is, is he a real thing? Yeah, Rafaelos. He's, he's mate, mate to the people. I'm looking at my phone. All right. I lied. No, I didn't. I think he dies. Benjamin's pretty good. Wall of Omens, okay. Frasca, we might go junk. Uh, oh yeah, remember that? Yeah. Um, <laughs> I guess take the Benjamin. Ryle's pretty Are scary. we going to play any of these? No. No. But we might bring this in for some reason that I can't currently find no. them. Um, Ooh, the she's good hermit. with tokens. Tokens, yeah. So I've heard. I think we should just go Frexian Obliterator. Splash Black. Splash. <laughs> Bubble Spit are also good with tokens. It is. I think I prefer the Supply Mark Angel though. It's kind of more fun, As, as well as like a flyer. It's kind of splashier. What do we cut? Buddy, what do we cut? Um, I don't like... Cord? You want to get rid of Cord? Cord, okay. Cord fetches these. All, these are all pretty good fetches for Cord, to be honest. Um... I'm so bad at doing cuts. I just want to keep all the cards. Um, Avenge is Avenger good because we're ramping with elves and artifacts. Do we yeah, have that you, many lands. You get less to you get less tokens, but the to like it's fine. Fates Fetter is a good card. You still think it's good enough though? Like if yes. we if we're ramping up to seven mana, is he still good to put down? There's the angel. Angel. He's still he's just still a five seven or a five five five. five. It's I mean, yeah. You know, makes more it, it, it feels to me like this deck is going to win. True tokens. We're super soft to wraths, aren't we? Yep. It's fine though, because we'll just play more big things. No, Thrun, Thrun. Cut Thrun. No, as in like he'll oh, live. See. He'll live through the wrath of God. Buddy, we gotta make a cut. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Wait, where do you feel about the Warhammer? I'm not, I'm not too taken with the Warhammer. I always feel the three mana equip cost is always. But mana's not gonna be an issue. That's too rich for my blood. Um. I think it's nice if any of these fail. To just chuck it on. Yeah, just just to have that fail safe sort of. Yeah, it's a really everything's stuff. a threat now. Yeah. Is it? Oh, he's good. He is not. If we're no, he's straight sideboard though. He's not better than anything we have. Hello. What's better, an arcane spell or a non-arcane version? I like the art on Kadam's reach better. God. He was left to make a cut. Come on, you decide. What? You decide. Never. Um, do we get rid of this quarter calling just because we want to be more threatening quicker? Quarter calling lets us tutor our stuff out. We don't have any card draw. Quarter of calling acts as a copy of whatever, yeah, we, need, whatever we need. This one has duplicate, duplicate removal. I think duplicate's really good. It's a super good, it's unbelievable yeah. card. Um, and it's colorless, which is good for. Alright, that's. That eats you. That's Do we need the Lotus? I'd really like the Lotus. Do we need it? That was my question was do we need it? I think so. I think to run Woodfall Prime. What other ramp do we have? We have one Kadama's Reach. Four L's referrals and an Awakening Zone and Kadama's Reach. That's a lot of, and That the, is a lot of ramp. And yeah. the core, that is okay, actually just okay, a lot yeah. of ramp. Oh. Like it's only eight. That's true. That is one more. Well, like you, but like you can play seven drops in like normal limited formats. Yeah. All right. Yeah. You know, and with all this stuff, and we don't have we don't have like, we don't have the Genesis wave. Tree speaker. We don't have something to do with like infinite mana. Yeah. Tree speaker taps for two herself. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Okay. Tree speaker eventually makes all this shit tap for. Or will well. tap for about three or four. Hopefully, we can probably run ten forests, I blue. Let's see what. Let's see what the eleven. Let's uh, see now. We've got these double whites, so I'd rather kind of go. Ten seven, yeah, yeah. We have we have green sources and all our elves, which don't make white anyway. So, Grafellas doesn't need to make more than two or three to be good. Yeah, all right. I'm happy with this. I'm happy with this. Let's uh, lose all of the rounds. Woo!